Hey all and welcome to the first ever airline episode where we look at the world's leading airlines. In this new series, I walk you through the birth of an airline, where it flies from, its cabin classes and offerings and of course talk you through the fleet. Today, we'll look at Air France. Air France was founded on the 7th of October in 1933. It was formed after the merger of five separate companies. The names are all in French, so instead of trying to pronounce them badly, I'm just gonna leave a title which will show you all the companies that merged together to form one Air France. So the story of Air France started in 1945 when Air France was granted the whole French air transport network. The first flight attendants were appointed a year later in 1946 and Air France started domestic operations from Le Brogier. Air France started off with a fleet of DC-3 aircraft. In 1974, the airline moved over to the newly constructed Charles de Gaulle airport and operated from there since then. Air France is a full-service airline. Line, offering domestic short-haul flights with economy and domestic business. They also offer full international flights with four cabin classes of service. Economy, premium economy, business, and the highest end La Premier cabin. They also have lounges known as La Salon, available from premium economy and up. Air France operates from Charles de Gaulle Airport to over 211 destinations prior to COVID. Now the fun part, the fleet of aircraft. Air France has an overall average fleet of aircraft, not the youngest but also not the oldest, and the general age of the fleet is at 10.9 years. Single hours include 18 Airbus A318-100s, 33 A319-100s, and these will be replaced with the 60 new A220-300 airplanes the airline has on order. Deliveries of the A220 are expected to be unaffected by the coronavirus crisis at a high rate starting in 2021 to phase out the older A318s and A319s by 2021. The larger single hours include the 44 A320 SEALs and 15 A321-200 airplanes. Interestingly, the airline has 5 A321-100 airplanes in its fleet, the first A321 models to enter service. Moving on to white bodies, the airline has 15 A330-200 airplanes in service, with 6 of the newest A350-900s and 32 more of the A350s on order. The 38 in total A350s will replace the airline's current 24 777-200ERs which will gradually be retired. The airline also has 43 777-300ERs with 4 cabin configurations. The most dense, in fact, seats 472, an impressive number. Lastly, they have 10 787-9s. In terms of the cargo fleet, Air France Cargo has two 777 freighters. Here are some fun facts I thought worth pointing out about Air France. They were the launch customer of the 777-300ER, 777 freighter, and of course were the first to fly the A320 series. Oh yes, and not to forget Concorde, of which they operated a fleet of seven.
So there you go. Air France certainly flies the flag of France high with a large network, excellent La Première service, and it's easy to say that France is certainly in the air. Thanks for tuning in and till we meet next time, one team, one aviation, one sky head.